All right, we're here with Caitlin Harris, and um, she is a, an education major here at Chipola. So, Caitlin, tell us what your major is. So, my major is elementary education. All right, and why did you choose that career path? I chose this career path because my mom has been my main inspiration. She has been in elementary education for 18 years now, and I wanted to provide a safe environment in which all students feel comfortable learning in and sharing their different ideas. Great. Um, Caitlin, what would you say to someone who's considering majoring uh, in elementary ed at Chipola? I would definitely encourage them to enroll at Chipola. There's such a great support system here present throughout the faculty and staff. Um, I've always felt like I could go to any instructor, especially Dr. McAllister. I could go to her for any question I ever need, and I was 100% supported all the way. All right, now I don't want to get you in trouble, but do you have a favorite teacher at Chipola? Um, I really don't have a favorite teacher from doing my AA degree to now being in the bachelor's program of education at Chipola. I've had so many phenomenal teachers and all of them have been so willing to help me, whether it's I come in during their office hours or I just shoot them an email asking them a question about an assignment. All right, now what about a favorite class? A favorite class is early and emergent literacy with Ms. Casey Dogle in the bachelor's program that I'm in. Um, it's really neat because I've got to learn about how like kids when they're first born to the time they reach the lower elementary grades what they should be expected to do as far as literacy development. Cool. Um, you're working at Chipola a little bit part-time. Tell us about that job. Yes. Um, so I actually started out in admissions when I was here at Chipola working on my AA degree and now I'm working in the human resources department and I've learned so many different skills being able to work here at Chipola and being able to learn more about the staff here makes me have even a better appreciation for the school I go to. Okay. And uh, when will you graduate with your bachelor's degree? I will graduate in May. Oh, fantastic. May of 2022? Yes, May okay. 2022, so this coming up, May. Okay, all right, and um, any special plans for what happens after graduation? Get a job um, at an elementary school, and I plan to pursue my master's in elementary education. Okay, and do you want to stay in the area? Um, yes, I do. Okay, all right, great. Well, Caitlin Harris, thanks for visiting with us today. Thank you so much.